modethmother.com. In this video, I want to discuss a classic error that I made. And this error is as relates to trying to short stocks when the RSIs are above 69.1. So yesterday, and I'll link the video in the description, I was issuing an alert for the group of stocks which are in the cannabis marijuana space. TLRY was the leader. And then the other one was CGC. And then there's the ETF MJ. And there's another stock CRON. Now I issued a short alert for this. Of course with caution. And the reason why I was cautious is because of course they're high flying momentum stocks. So yesterday this is what the chart did close at. And we tried to short this actually at about 148. Now take a look at this very beautiful move, right? The stock breaks out here on the weekly and pretty much it's lights out since then. And we can see that this breakout as of yesterday had moved from 30 roughly to the highs here of 155. So I need to stress that the fundamental error here is to if you take a look at the daily now, we can see the daily was trading with the RSI above 69.1. In fact, the RSI had been above 69.1 since this period here in the in the higher 20s. And the more the RSI held above 69.1, you can see the reaction. And this is why we have to be very careful. In fact, let me say this, we need to ignore the temptation to short stocks that are showing this type of power and this is the fundamental error that I personally made now if you take a look also at the two hourly again even yesterday the RSI was above 69.1 this is not where you want to short this is just telling you that there's possibility of higher prices be aware in other words if you own the stock you need to hold on as long as the RSI is defended and as long as the RSI is above 69.1, take a look at the hourly chart. Even on the hourly chart, you can see the RSI remained above 69.1. So again, all the time frames, if you take a look at the 30-minute chart, you can see the RSI also did close above 69.1. So you got your daily, you got your two hourly, you got your hourly, you got your 30 minute chart, all of them above 69.1. This is a sign of strength. And I'll show you how this has pretty much slapped us in the face. And the reason is I wake up this morning to find that the stock is up an additional 50%. As you can see here, in fact, it's the headliner. <laughs> so that is in your face mistake a rookie mistake because i should know better i know that stocks we all know or at least i teach that stocks above 69.1 should be respected so yes a great mistake here and if you take a look at the pre-market action you can see in the pre-market the stock is trading as high as 239 remember yesterday it closed at a, just under 155 now is showing intraday pre-market in the morning here with about 45 minutes to go it is trading at 224 the high being at 239 or oh, by the way you can also see here on this chart that the rsi is trading close to let me see whether we can get that rsi reading to show up but the rsi is in the 90s so again, confirmation that it is a rookie mistake to try and short or get out if you own it, get out of an instrument with the RSI holding above 69.1. So not to self, respect the power of RSI 69.1. I'll keep tracking this to see whether we find an opportunity down the road to see whether we can benefit from any major decline that it could set up for 
down the road. So I'll, I'll continue watching this. Of course, a mistake was made yesterday, but doesn't mean that there's no opportunity down the road once the chart gives us those indication that there's a possibility of a major reversal. Eric Moab with Mother.com. A mistake was made, but we can learn from it. Be aware of what it means when an instrument is trading above 69.1. Eric Moab with Mother.com. As always, good luck, peace, and blessings. And so it is. E-A-C-S.